scene, man. Hoo wee! <laughs> then they just plop you out here like a naked baby in the woods. <laughs> How about that? Ah, uh, look, you know, it's probably a lot for you to take in, so, uh, why don't you let me show you the ropes? What do you say? I'm Jack. What's important is I'm offering help. You make it back from Santa Monica with your hide and we'll trade life stories, okay? Till then, I got about this much time. You in or out? All right. Now, we ain't got much time, but I figure somebody should fill you in on the bare bones stuff at least. You know, could save your hide. You look wobbly. You even had a drink yet? Oh, man, we're popping a cherry here. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, you're going to love this. All right, check it out. Blood, it's your new rack of lamp, your new champagne. Blood, your new fucking heroin, kid. <laughs> Get ready, though, because, hey, it's never as sweet as the first time. Well, down around the corner there, I saw this human. Poor SOB can't find his car. <laughs> All right. You go down there, casual like. You creep up on them, then bear those little fangs and feed. Don't worry if you weren't captain of the wrestling team or something, because it'll come so naturally you think you've done it a thousand times already. Now go for it. Be sure, though, and this is important, so listen up. Be sure not to drain them dry, okay? It might be hard to resist, but don't kill them. Inside you lifting you up. That's it, kid. That's what it's all about right there. All right, now. You got the blood. You're feeling all kick-ass, feeling better than your best day living. But wait, it gets better. All kindred. Kindred, that's a our word for vampire. All kindred have a few things in common. Things that set them right square above humans on the food chain. Like sharper senses, a body that can take a beating, and if you play your cards right, eternal life. That's no sure bet, but still, a chance at immortality is not a bad deal. And that's just for starters. French benefits for joining the club. Well, you can still be destroyed, but forget the books and the movies. Garlic? It's worthless. A cross? Pfft, shove it right up their ass. <laughs> a steak? Only if it catches you in the heart, and then it just paralyzes you. Running water? Eh, that's no problem. I bathe. Eh, occasionally. Now, a shotgun blast to the head. Oh, that's trouble, boy. Fire? That's real trouble. Sunlight? Well, you catch a sunrise and it's all over, kiddo. Get it? Okay, now. <laughs> what the fuck is this? You get inside here and head upstairs. Meet up with them. I'm just gonna go see what the ruckus is.
down here. Stay away from the windows. Oh, it's a Sabat raid. A Sabat? They're, uh... Ah, Christ, I was hoping to spare you this shit till later. Uh, a Sabat? Well, uh, They're mostly mindless, bloodthirsty assholes. That's all you need to know for now, all right? The Sabat got wind of the gathering here, so they figured they'd raise a little hell and put a little heat on the new prince. No time for political rundown. Job one, get out of here alive. Sabat might be mindless, but they hit like a Mack truck, like raging savages. Nothing a fledgling like you wants to mess with. Shh, shh. Heads up. Back away. <laughs>